So when I went out to meet with the nutty St. Paul Saints baseball team, I actually found out something very interesting about the baseballs themselves. I'm sitting here with John. He is the crew chief, the head umpire. So John, now they say you're rubbing up the balls mm -hmm. and you have to use a special dirt. That's right. Why is that? Well. If you just use any old dirt, uh, it's going to end up being gritty. You've got to use a special mud. It's a very smooth mud. It comes from New Jersey and the Delaware River. Really? And, uh, yeah, and it, it'll, it'll, what it'll do is it'll take the shine off the baseball, first of all, uh, so that it's better to be seen. So is this every baseball in America? Every baseball that is used in a professional baseball game, yes. Uses mud from New Jersey. That's right. And it's got to be New Jersey mud. It's got to be from the Delaware River in New Jersey. That's right. You know, back in the old days, baseball players took shine off new balls by rubbing regular mud on them. But that made them all dark and soggy, so it was a pretty big problem. In 1938, a baseball coach named Lena Blackburn found some muck in the Delaware River that had just the right texture. By the 1950s, every single major league team has been using that muck from the Delaware River. So you actually are not only the head ump, you're the head ball rubber. I am the head ball rubber on the days when I work the plate. Generally, the well, plate Well, I bet your parents are proud of you. They really are. <laughs> yeah. What's your son doing? Hey, he's a head ball rubber up there at the major league. <laughs> he rubs the balls for everybody to play with. That's right. How much most you can do? I could probably do this dozen in about two minutes. Really? Yeah. Can we get two minutes on the clock, please? And go. He's got some mud on his hands. Now he's about to take a ball. There he is. A little bit of water. He does that. He mixes them. Look at this. Look at this. You got some friction going now, don't you? Years of practice. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this. And these are going to be used in the game today. These will be used in the game. And you think you'll go through all three dozen balls? Oh, easily, yeah. We'll really? Through. We generally get close to using all five dozen that we rub. Really? Stop the clock. Minute and 17 seconds. Look at you. And guess what? The location where they get the muck is still a secret. Only one descendant of Mr. Blackburn knows the spot. And we are set. Now, could you get him so dark you'd ruin him? Yes, you can. I think I've done that. Yeah. And time. Minute 17. Whoa, we tied it up. Wow. Now, let's, uh, let's compare balls. All right. This is a first for the History Channel. <laughs> Larry and I know I'm comparing balls. OK, these are my balls. These are head umps balls. Mine are a little dark. They're a little dark and a uh, little camouflaged as well. So these we will definitely be using in the game. Th those will be used, yeah. These are a travesty. Unfortunately, I don't think any of those are getting in the game tonight. I'm sorry. Really? So we just ruined these balls? Uh, probably. They might make nice souvenirs, though.